Welcome, this is Paula Chafee Scardamalia, DivinningTheMuse.com, with your three-card tarot reading for your creativity and your creative work. For today, Wednesday, May 16th. Okay, your focus card for today is the King of Swords. It seems to be the week for kings. So today, the focus is on the element of air. Swords has to do with air, mind, thoughts, attitudes, and beliefs. You can see the king here is very elevated, and his sword is point down. He doesn't need to raise it to threaten or to use it. Um, he is imbued with his own sense of power and knowledge, and others respect that. So how do you get this? Because air has to do with communications. Focus today on how you are getting your, your uh, message out um, maybe via uh, emails, uh, social media, online, blogging, so forth, about your creative work in a way that is confident and clear, yet not pushy. Your action card for today, this came up uh, earlier in the week as well. This uh, action card is the Seven of Coins. You can see the coins in the tree here, the woman standing here admiring um, her potential harvest. Coins has to do with the element of earth, Money, home, health, anything you touch, taste, or feel. So your action today is to pay attention to the final details. Where is your project now and what are the things you need to be doing to finish it up? Take those steps today to start put it, putting the finishing touches on that project so you can harvest the reward. And then finally, the gift today is the gift of faith. And this is a major arcana card. Um, in other decks, it's called the Hierophant. You can see the four different... Um, men who represent the four different major faiths in the world and the light uh, beaming down here. So your gift today is the gift of faith, a connection to spirit, to the divine, to that source of inspiration within you that gives you the power to keep moving and keep going forward. So as we look at the story for today, this is um, coming from a, just a very practical, alert, aware kind of place. Uh, focus on how you communicate with your tribe about your work in a way that is clear and concise and confident but not pushy. Then today, take those final steps to finish up a project that um, is near completion so that you can reap the rewards. And then look for that moment, those few moments, that gift of faith that gives you that connection to the divine and lets you know you're on the right path. And this is Paula Chafee Scardamalia of DivinningTheMuse.com, wishing you divine musings.